Hey YouTube, it's Grace, and in this video, I'm going to be showing you how I made my latest commission, which I'll give you a little sneak peek. It was a space painting! <laughs> this painting ended up being a little bit smaller than my usual ones just because um, it was an international order, and with larger paintings, I just feel like it's more risky to ship overseas because sometimes <laughs> the post office just butchers things or throws an anvil on them or I honestly don't know what they do but I don't trust them at all anymore. But anyways, let's get into the video. So these are the reference images I was sent. I think I'm gonna go with more of this design but try to incorporate more of the colors from this one because I like both of these and I want to try to combine them. This is my canvas. It is 12 by 12. Normally my commissions are a bit bigger but this one is going to Germany and I don't really want the shipping to cost too much and also just the bigger the canvas the higher the risk of it being damaged so we just decided on this. I'm gonna start by blocking out the rough ideas of where each color goes so black at the top and the bottom and then pink and white in the middle. This is a major trust the process moment, but I need to let this dry um, and then I'm gonna go in and actually make it look good. Okay, it's been about an hour. It is dry now, so I'm going to add a second coat and really just focus on blending everything and making it look a lot smoother. Here it is after the second coat. I even did the sides of the canvas. So now I'm gonna wait for this to dry overnight and go in and add a whole bunch of details. Okay, it is now the next day. This is completely dry. So I'm going to start by blocking in these sort of cloud shapes. I know they're not clouds cause it's in space, but that's what they look like. So that's what I'm calling them. <laughs> I think I have a decent start on the clouds now, um, but before I get too far into it, I want to start on the stars, um, and for that I'm just going to be using a white paint marker. Um, and the reason that I want to start on the stars now is one, because I'm impatient, but also because I want to have some clouds over them and then I'll have more of like a layering effect, and I think that would look really cool. I've been looking at this painting and thinking and I got the idea to add some more clouds kind of like here and here so that it looks more like a spiral galaxy that you're kind of viewing from the side. I think that would look really cool. I think I've defined the rings of the spiral uh, decently so I'm gonna go in and add some more stars especially on the spiral part because if you think about it that's the reason that it's lit up because there's lots of stars. <laughs> I've decided that this painting needs purple because when in doubt I'm just going to add more color. <laughs> so I blended out some of the purple and I also added some far away galaxies that are glowing a bit and I think I need to make those faded a bit more they just seem a bit bright. I was just gonna let this dry but the light spots bothered me so I just faded them out a bit and I think it looks way better now. I did a little bit of work off camera with making the stars bigger and also just adding some more clouds and I just got the idea to add um, little flakes of glitter just in the center of some of the stars and then also adding a little bit of glow paint on some of the stars so that it glows in the dark. So I just sent a picture of this painting to the person who's commissioning me um, just to ask if they had any suggestions for what I should add next and they really like it so far but said it would be cool if I could add some planets and just some like blue cloud colors. Um, so that's what I'm gonna do next. So I added some blue sort of around the edges of this galaxy, um, also added some blue clouds which I think I'm going to blend out a bit more, um, and now I'm adding some different 
planets. I'm going to have rings on some of them. Some of them are just gonna be circles, but I'm gonna add a few different colors and I think that's gonna bring this piece together a bit more. One thing I always like to do is extend the painting onto the edges of the canvas. So now I'm just putting a few stars around all four sides. And this is the final result. This is how it turned out. I love it so much, honestly. I think the colors and the design is just so cute. Here it is compared to the last space painting I did. I think they look really cool together too. This is my first time ever doing a commission like this, but after finishing this one, I feel a lot more confident in my abilities, so I'm hoping that I get more in the future. If you would like to commission me for a space painting or a pixel painting or anything like that, uh, this is my Instagram. I do commissions on there. I have all my info pinned on my account, um, but if you have any questions, DM me because I will definitely answer. But yeah, that's it for this video, so thank you very much for watching, and I hopefully will see you in my next one.